Hey everyone, Anthony here, and welcome back to my channel. So today, I am starting a new Let's Play, and I know what you guys are thinking. You started like 50 million new ones and haven't completed any of them, and I know, and I deserve all this criticism I should get. But hear me out. Every time I've been picking up these other saves that I've started, for some reason something isn't just clicking, and I think it's because it's always certain things I'm doing, like a Generations LP or like Rags to Riches, and it's always following certain things that I just get burned out. So I decided I wanted to start a new LP where I just go with the flow. It's literally just a simple The Sims 3 LP. I'm going to play with The Sim and see where it takes me, and I also want to get you guys involved a lot. So basically, like, each episode, I want you guys to give me some guidance on where you think this character should go. So, character, I mean Sim, on where this Sim should go. So, like, if there are any, like, big, like, things that come up in her lifetime, like, in her wishes or anything, or, like like picking a partner or something or like a job or some like a job opportunity later on i want you guys to help me decide so uh, probably every episode or so there will be some type of decision i want you guys to make and comment about so you can basically control her through me as well so we can basically give her the best life we want to give her but anyway that's enough ranting about literally nothing i'm going to introduce you to my sim and we're going to get into some gameplay because my favorite part is always just getting straight into the gameplay because i feel like the first episodes are usually always boring so I'm hoping for this one, I can just jump straight into it and it'll feel like it's not even the first episode. So let's introduce you to The Sim. So this is Rhea Sorensen. She is so pretty. I made her about like a day ago and I was like, I kind of want to use her for an LP. So I'm just like, why not? Um, she has some tattoos, as you can see. She also has some like on her legs, but you can't see that because of her jeans. So anyway, Rhea Sorensen. Her traits are eco-friendly, loves the heat, artistic, mooch and ambitious her favorites are red sushi and pop music and she is a taurus her lifetime wish is to be a home design hotshot which is earn 100 top scores for jobs in the architectural design profession so all my time playing the sims or watching the sims i've never seen anyone complete this lifetime wish and i've only played with the ooh, uh, my camera jump. I've only played with this, like, career only a few times, so I don't really know what to expect. And from when I've watched it on, like, other series, I feel like this lifetime which is impossible to get, so even if we don't get it, it's fine. I just really wanted to try out the architectural design career. But, yeah, as you can see, her wish is already to join it. But, yeah, as you can see, we live in the town of Bridgeport. I was trying to think of some words I, worlds I never really play in, and I feel like I never really play in the city type of vibe. It's usually more, like, neighborhoods like this in most of the city, like, the places I play in or the worlds I play in. So I wanted to try something new. And Bridgeport, like, I, I usually don't play in it that much because I don't really... I don't know, there was something about it I didn't like. I think it was, like, the lighting and stuff, but since I have a lighting mod now and, like reshade and stuff it looks pretty so i think i'm just gonna I'm, I'm okay with it so we live in an apartment building right here um i don't know if, oh yeah 1557 memorial parkway um I, I decided to choose an apartment because in bridgeport i feel like it doesn't make sense if you're gonna choose a, ho a starter house to begin in so yeah this is the lobby way i guess and i'll give you a little tour of her apartment i did some configuring to this apartment like i made it it was like a studio originally but i like gave it some walls oh wow I forgot how insane the camera was in this uh, an apartment, so I'm just gonna walk through like this. But basically, this is the entrance. You walk basically right into the kitchen. The kitchen I kept pretty much the same. So yeah, um, before there used to be like half walls dividing this, but instead I made it into a full room. So the hallway space is kind of small, but like, it, I don't really care that much. So as you walk into here, here's like a little living area, and I made sure to add this table because she sh she's artistic, and she's going to be an architectural design career, so she needs going to need to research some architectural design on this table, and it can boost her um, painting skill. Um, here's like a little dining table, and then over here is the bathroom. I didn't really change much of it, I just like changed where things were in it. And then over here is her bedroom. Since her favorite color is red, I decided to go for a dark red theme. Don't know if I necessarily like it too much, but we have a computer, so the we have we can basically have everything in this house. Like she will never really need to leave. And I think what we're definitely gonna do first is get her in the architectural design career. So you know what? Since we have a computer, I might as well just get her to do it on the computer. And while we're at it, I think I'm gonna make her a dating profile. So let's see. Jobs and professions, find a profession. I think I might as well go ahead and um uh oh as you can see, I deducted the money there because um, uh, she had so much money for some reason when I moved her in and decorated the apartment that I didn't, I didn't want her to have all that money because I was decorating to how I wanted. But um, basically, oh, she's waiting for the elevator. 
Um, I'm gonna have her find her profession now. We're gonna make a dating profile. And to me, I think Rhea is bisexual. I've just decided that right now. So she's gonna go for both the men and the women. So I will be sending um, requests to um, everyone. Oh, oh, she got stuck in the elevator. I mean, this is Loki. Oh my god, I forgot how insane the camera was. I need to be careful. I just wanted to take a photo. Anyway, oh, and she's on the ground. <laughs> anyway, I just want her to get in touch with the whole world, basically. So, oh, yep, got trapped in the elevator doors. Look at how pretty this world is from here. Like, she literally, like, out her window, this is what she sees. I think that's beautiful. I, I think it's pretty. Don't know how pretty it would be to actually live in it, though. I feel like, I don't really have a fear of heights, but I feel like if I were all the way up here, all alone, and, like, seeing out the window, it'd freak me out. Okay. Architectural designer. So our weekly stipend would be 272 simoleons, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. She works Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So let's accept that. That's cool. She has her design portfolio, so that's when she'll probably be taking pictures. She wants to earn 500 simoleons as an architectural designer. Well, hopefully we can do that, because every time I've played with it, everyone always hates my designs. And also, one thing I wanted to ask. So when I would play it before... Um, I'm just gonna hang up her diploma on the wall, and I'm gonna have her make, um, online dating profile while I talk, but, um, someone explained this to me. So whenever I do this career, I use CC Furniture, and I can't tell if that, like, bugs the game with exactly what the client wants, because I can't tell if that's, like, it doesn't classify CC as something specific, so if anyone knows that, please let me know in the comments below. Um, here we go. We'll keep uh, her profile the exact same. She wants to browse through some profiles, so we can do that. Go ahead and browse through some profiles. She needs some fun. Maybe we can go out on the town soon. Okay, Vladimir is something. Um, wow, these people are not the best looking. The only ones I like are Alexi and Raphael. So we'll send them some messages. Then we'll also look at the women. Um, she wants to buy a street art kit. I can do that. She wants to learn the painting skill. We're not going to take a class because we don't have the money. Oh, do you hear that? Are they raving in the apartment next to us? You know what? Maybe we should meet our neighbor, actually. I'll ring their bell afterwards. Um, anyway, we're not enrolling in university because it's not a university LP. Okay, you know what? I might as well buy her uh, a street art kit. Because she wants one, so let's go ahead and do that. Where are they? Here they are. I'm just going to put it... Uh... Sorry if my game's a little laggy. Whenever I load up right into it, that's how it is. I'm sure you've heard me say that like 10 million times, but I'm just going to go ahead and put that in her inventory. Cool. Okay. Let's go ahead and browse some more. Yeah, let's send one to um, Alexi. And then let's also check out the women. Because why not? Come on, Rhea. I love her name too. Rhea Sorensen, it just flows so well off the tongue. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, Marina's pretty. So is Polly. And Caitlyn. But she looks like she'd be, like, famous. So I think the only one we're going to send one to so far is Marina. And then we'll see. Oh. University mascot is here. He's downstairs, probably. We can sell the university kit. The time portal's probably going to show up soon in a second, too, so we'll get some extra change there as well. But why don't you go ahead and ring the bell of your neighbor? Let's go ahead and meet our neighbor. We're going to be living with them, or next to them, for quite some time, but... Oh, she's getting freaked out at the door. Okay, anyway. She is so pretty. You'll see her other outfits as well, by the way, when the LP goes on. Um, oh. There's the portal. Where is it? Where'd it go? Hello? Oh, it's right here. I'm just gonna sell that. Cool. Got some cash. Let's see. We rang the doorbells. Anyone gonna welcome us in or what? Oh, it's this guy. Ronald Heath. I mean, hello. It, he, he lives in this apartment, right? Oh, nobody's home. Just kidding. Nobody old enough home? Okay. So, I don't know where this guy came from. Um, I guess we'll just talk to him. That's weird. Um, so I think, as our first day out of the town, well, it's not really nighttime yet, so I don't think I'm gonna go to, like, a club or anything until tonight, but I just wanna go somewhere and start meeting some sims, so... I want to, she wants to know his sign, please. Um, also, I should probably make some sims for this town. I'll let you know when I make some and place some down so that we can have more of an option to our tastes, you know? Um, I don't know. I think maybe we'll just chill at home until tonight, and then we can go out in the town, to the club, meet some people. Sounds like a plan. And like I said, oh, 
Okay, he's a dot. That's really cool. Thank you, Ronald, for letting me know. Oh, he's also a workaholic. Um, anyway, let's just keep talking to him. But don't forget that, like I said earlier, you guys can suggest anything you want in this series. Because I really want to just, like, work together to make Rio's life the best it can be. So I'm really curious to see where this LP takes us. It's going to be very chill. I'm basically just going to be doing what I feel like doing. No incentive in the end. We're just going to be living through Rio's life. Okay, you can keep talking to him, I guess. Um, you know, I feel like he is taken. I just have a suspicion. So I'm just going to ask if he's single. Ask his sign. And then... I don't know if he'll, like, accidentally invite himself in. But I'm just going to go ahead and have her start researching some architectural design. Um, oh, they share the same alma mater. Okay, cool, I guess. They went to public school 67. Okay. Um, oh. Why, why do you think it was awkward? He doesn't want us to ask if he's single or his sign. Wait, is he a teenager? Okay, no, he's an adult. Who that scared me for a second. Bruh, who is calling me? But answer the phone. Who's already calling me? Matilda Smart. Oh, I guess it's neighbors. Okay, well, we can meet some neighbors, I suppose. Uh, are they gonna come up, or what? Hello? Neighbors. Okay, she's just gonna watch TV, I guess. You know, I know this house isn't as decorated as it could be, but since it's a starter apartment, I didn't want to go too crazy. Plus, building these walls was literally enough. Ooh, okay, Matilda. She is serving, I guess. Don't really know what she's serving, but she's serving. Let me say hi to her. Model, mm -mm. go do a friendly introduction. She's pretty, though. This is Maddie Crew. We'll say hi to him as well. She's very pretty. Uh, she wants to visit the art gallery. Pfft, not today. Um, okay, he looks like a very, like a hippie. Okay, I don't care what anyone thinks you're hot. Well, looks like Rio's already making waves on her first day in town. Let's just start talking to them. Uh, oh, okay, she, he doesn't care about us, that's cool. Um, oh, I didn't mean to ask her about her age, but I guess we will. I'm gonna ask her her what, what career she's in. Um, oh, so they're exactly the same age, how cool. Cool, they're just talking. Her outfit is really a statement. Where'd he go? Why is he in my room? Bro, get out of my room. Um, she works at a day spa. Okay. Uh, go ahead and keep talking to her. We definitely will throw, like, a little welcoming party later on when we know enough Sims, but my thing is I'm just gonna pretend that she moved from a different town wanting to start fresh because of something in her past. Maybe you guys can make that up, but... Um... Let's gossip to Mr. Maddie. Forgot his name already. Um, oh, I forgot that she's a mooch. We would definitely be using that to our advantage. Um, let's just high-five him, I guess. I don't know. And then after that, I'm just going to ask everyone to leave, because I want her to continue her sketch a little bit, and then she's going to head out tonight. So, why don't you continue your sketch, girl? God, taking screenshots in this apartment is going to be so hard, because like, look at how crazy the camera is. Ugh, that's the one thing I do not like about cameras. Okay, I said that wrong. I meant that's the one thing I don't like about apartments, please. It's the same thing in The Sims 4. I've also been playing The Sims 4 a little more recently. Um, watching LPs on it make me go back into it, but then when I play it, I get bored again. So, I don't know. If you guys want to see any Sims 4 videos, let me know. Because I love building in The Sims 4. But I've never really played The Sims 4 on this channel. Because I'm usually mainly just Sims 3. But if you guys want to see that, just let me know. Um, she's going to go ahead and... Continue her sketch a little bit. She can use the bathroom when she's done. She's a little hungry, but I think wherever we go tonight, we'll probably have food in, and we'll have some drinks, so it'll work. Um, her first um, uh, day on the career is tomorrow, but I think I'm probably only going to play one day with you guys because I'll get into the career in the next episode after I get some intel from y'all about what y'all want Rhea to do with her life. So uh, I feel like all my words I'm saying are so jumbled right now, but it's because I'm really excited to play this. Because I've been really wanting to get back into The Sims 3 because I feel like I have so many phases. And now, I it's always like, when I'm about to get off of a break, I feel like I want to play The Sims. Even though during the whole break before, I did not want to play it all. So, that seems to always be the case. So, I'm going to have her use the bathroom. I think most places usually open at 5, so we'll give it like about 20 more Sim minutes. We'll have to give herself a little pep talk. She can check herself out. I can always hear other people in other apartment. It freaks me out. Okay, it's 5 o'clock. Where should we head to tonight? We have Wayland's Haunt. Um, where else? We have the Brightmoor. Um, 
Bridgeport Sports Zone, UGs. Let, let's head to the Brightmoor. I think I would like this one. I don't want to go to really a pub. I want to go to like a for real, for real club. So let's head out with her. Cool. She's waiting for the elevator. I think basically 50 minutes of our day will be getting from point A to point B because of all the subways and stuff. Ooh, that's the newspaper. I need to call the services and cancel that because the newspaper is like one of the most annoying things I think in this game. But that's just me. Oh, I forgot. I should have made her eco-friendly because now, like, whenever she's in the taxi, she's going to be pissed. Whatever. Let's just head to the club. Oh, she's already here. Dang, this game is laggy in this town. I'm hoping as this series goes on, it'll get better, but... I hope it doesn't annoy you guys as much as it annoys me. I don't know if it ruins the viewing experience. Oh, okay, we already got some people here. Why don't you head up to level... That's a B1. Yep. Okay, these people are serving. She is so pretty. Okay. Oh, wow. This... Oh, this place is popping off. Hello? Wow. Wait, is it for VIP people only? Like, do I have to be a celebrity to get into here? I hope not. Oh. That's... Oh, wait. I have to ask to get in? Shoot. Okay. Um... Okay, that's a VIP room. Are these all VIP rooms? That is so rude, actually. Let's see. Let's... Let's ask this bouncer if we can get in. Hopefully it'll work. What's her name? Bethany Pickard. Please, Bethany. Oh, oh. Oh my god, she let me in. Okay. Wait, we kind of served. Okay, this place is cool. Hello? Oh, who's this? Kai Liko. Let's introduce ourselves. I'm just going to introduce myself to everyone who walks in. Let's go ahead and order a drink. Let's get a purple gnome. That sounds fun. Bro, why is he standing like that? Okay, cool. Oh my god, literally everyone in this town already thinks we're hot. Bro, where is the music coming from? This music is popping. Cool. Hopefully it's not too loud for y'all. Let's go ahead and order a drink. Wow, I should really play in Bridgeport more. I love this this vibe. Ooh, who's this? Lola Bell? Uh, oh, we already know her, I guess? Interesting. Okay. Um, who's this? Barry Tenderlove. We can say hi to him. Cool. Hey, Ryan Westbrook, get me my drink. Oh, okay. This drink. Sorry, I love getting screenshots. Oh, also, if you haven't known me already, this is the first LP you're watching of mine. I love taking screenshots, and it will annoy the gameplay, so if it ever gets to be too much, please let me know. Um, let's say hi to this guy, Ace Wild. Okay. John... Sue? I don't know how to say that. I'm so sorry if I mispronounced that. I'm just gonna say hi to everyone. I wanna get to know this whole town. There's the one thing- oh my god, everyone finds her hot. Anyway, the one thing about my gameplay is that, like, my sims never have friends. And I just- they always have such bad social lives. Like, I really need to work on it. Oh wow, the first person who doesn't think we're hot. Is he a teenager? No, he's- he's an adult. He looks like a teenager. Let's meet Miss John. Cute. Okay, I love this place. It's popping. Yes. Okay. Oh, this guy. He kind of looks a little... What's the word? Anyway, let's order some bar food because she's hungry. Let's have um, some nachos. Because why not? Oh, what's those speech bubbles over there? Oh, they're hungry. Looks like these two are going to start talking to each other. Let's get some nachos. Cool. Okay. Oh, this wall is cool. It's like stars. Oh, is it thunderstorming outside? Dang. Oh, it's pretty outside, though, but it's thunderstorming. Ooh. Oh, I didn't realize this is in, like, this is downstairs. I thought it was upstairs. Oh, that's cool. She's eating her nachos, like the queen she is. She's getting tired, but it's okay. She doesn't work till 8, and, like, for the architectural design career, you don't have to be there right at time, so... Let me take a little photo of her. Oh, they're dancing in the back. Okay. Oh, I need to get a good photo. There we go. Um, let's see. Is anyone else here? No, everyone else is not here right now. I guess I'll have her dance. Why not? Dance the night away. She is so pretty. Oh my god, every time I look at her. I said about all my sims, but... Oh, okay. She's rooting what's her name on, Lola. Come on, get it down. Get it down. Okay. Okay, actually, she picked a horrible spot because the light's literally on her. Go here and dance. Thank you, queen. 
Oh, she is serving. Serving. Look at her. Okay, Rhea. Oh. Okay. First night on the town, and she's already getting it down. I love her. I'm ready to tell she's gonna be one of my favorite Sims. Oh. Okay. What's going on over here? You better go to the bathroom before you pee yourself, Lola. Ugh. I feel like I want Lola to be like a close BFF to Rhea. I want to talk to her more. Let's let's greet her. She has to use the bathroom. We'll get her after she's done using it. Oh, okay. Just kidding. She's gonna literally pee herself in front of us. I'll talk more to her. Let's hmm, let's ask her. Ooh, let's not do that just yet. Let's ask her about her career. Ask her about her alma mater. Ask if she's single. Just like the general stuff to get to know her. Gossip with her a little. I want to be close to Lola. She seems cool. Oh, she's in the music industry, and they're both ambitious. That's iconic. Oh. Oh. Vladimir is booing her when you look like that. What a skank. Anyway. Okay, let's speed this up. After this, I think she's going to head home because she's tired. I want them to be friends, though, so maybe I'll wait a second. Oh, dang. Lola's single. Uh, not the mixologist dancing now. He's crazy. Um, actually, I'll have her go home when she becomes friends with Lola, like, for sure. And I think I'll end the part there. I think it was a successful first day on the town. Miss Rhea Sorensen. Dang, that vampire just keeps whooshing in and out. Okay, keep going, queen. Come on. Speed this up. See, doing the show funny video thing is the quickest way to make friends in this game. Because, like, the it goes up so fast, I feel like. Okay, almost there. Come on. Oh, wait. This guy's fine. Oh, wait, it's Matthew Hemming. We need to say hi to him. Because he's fine. And I think he's rich, too. Okay, we didn't become friends with her. She wants to... Oh, wait. We did become friends with her. Awesome. And we met Mr. Matthew. You know, I always thought Matthew was attractive in this game, so... You guys can let me know what you think of that. But let's go ahead and have Rhea head home. She had a long first day here, and I think in the next part, she'll start her career and we'll have a little welcoming party to the town, because look, we already know a bunch of people, so that'll work out, and she'll definitely meet people, like, in her career as we, like, go ahead and decorate their homes, but I'm just going to send her to home to sleep. Why is she running home? She's such a freak. Oh, wait, no, she's going through the subway. Okay. I mean, if you took a cab there, why can't you just take a cab back? I guess this is her way of being eco-friendly, even though a subway is probably not as eco-friendly. Well, I mean, it is a little more eco-friendly than I... Actually, don't quote me on that, I have no idea. Oh my god, there's a food truck right here. We should use that sometime when she's actually hungry. Okay, queen. Oh, this is her house, cool. Let's go ahead and get you in bed, so you can be ready for your first day of your new job tomorrow. Ooh, she's gonna have horrible... She's gonna be, like, not rested at all when she wakes up tomorrow to go to her first day at work. Hopefully we actually get a job, and hopefully it actually goes well, because, I don't know, please let me know about that CC thing. I really don't know if it's like, if that affects anything, and I really hope it doesn't, but let's go ahead and send her to sleep. Okay, y'all. This is where I'm going to end the episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys will enjoy Rhea's journey as she lives in Blitch... Uh, Bridgeport. Bridgeport. Please let me know any ideas you have for her. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I hope you guys are having a great day or night wherever you guys are, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.